You won't believe the latest piping gossip that just dropped. And it's all about Beth Dutton's previous fizzled out romances. No matter how hard Kelly tries to avoid the spotlight off screen, there's something that puts her back into it. What are we talking about? Keep watching till the end to learn everything you need to know about Kelly. Beth Dutton's a beast. Kelly Riley has been making waves and turning heads with her role as Beth Dutton in Yellowstone. She's the force behind the fiery and fierce Beth Dutton. But is Kelly like that in real life as well? Hmm, not according to her. Did you know that Kelly once called her character Beth a beast? Yep, she's not just any character, she really is a force to be reckoned with. And quite frankly, playing Beth is not a walk in the park at all. But here's the juicy part. When the cameras stop rolling, Riley couldn't be more different from her on-screen alter ego. Yep, according to Kelly herself, she's like the yin to Beth's yang. Can you imagine? Kelly is actually really shy and gentle in real life. That's why she keeps on escaping the paparazzi's eye all the time. Because even before Yellowstone, Kelly has been hustling in Hollywood. This gal has been through the ringer. Sure, she might not have as many battle scars as Beth, and who does? But she's definitely got some stories to tell. For starters, did you know that Beth actually loves horses in real life? Before she graced our screens as the formidable Beth, she was actually living the equestrian dream. In an interview with the Evening Standard, she told all about her horse obsession. She confessed that she couldn't afford a horse, but she did adopt one, and she spent a lot of her time with him. That's the dedication we see in Beth as well. But guess what? If it weren't for showbiz swooping in, Riley might still be knee-deep in hay. Can you imagine a world without our beloved Beth Dutton? Despite her love for horses, Riley doesn't actually spend a ton of time on horses in Yellowstone. Can you believe it? In an interview with WFAA, she stated that she grew up riding and it's really sad that she's the only character that doesn't ride horses in the show. But hey, when she's not busy with the drama on set, Riley's all about hitting the trails in real life. According to Parade, she loves to escape to the great outdoors whenever she can. It helps her to get a clearer head. All of this makes us wonder about Kelly's childhood. Did this British actor grow up with horses? What was her deal before she became Beth Dutton? Humble Beginnings Ready to uncover the humble roots of Kelly? The story is actually fascinating. From her demeanor, it looks like Kelly used to live a high life. But that assumption couldn't be more wrong. Her journey from ordinary beginnings to Hollywood stardom is a juicy tale. This gal, the epitome of elegance and sophistication, hails from the street of Chessington in Greater London. Yep, despite what her glamorous roles might have you think. In an interview with the Evening Standard, Kelly revealed about her blue-collar upbringing. Can you believe that her dad was a police officer and her mom worked as a receptionist at the antenatal clinic? Who would have thought? But hold on, here's where it gets more interesting. Despite Kelly's reputation for playing fancy pants characters like Caroline Bingley in Pride and Prejudice, Kelly is anything but an upper-class snob. She has spent a lot of time with elites, but she has no sympathy for them. That's the real Kelly Riley behind all the Hollywood glamour. In fact, due to her father's job, her family grew up in a very normal suburban home. A fun fact here is that Kelly never imagined that she could be an actor. The queen of the screen thought she couldn't hack it in showbiz. But hey, fate works in mysterious ways, doesn't it? According to The Telegraph, drama was Riley's secret weapon. She loved theater even in school. And all thanks to one perceptive teacher who saw something special in Kelly. Riley revealed to the Evening Standard that her teacher put her in his wife's drama group. That's where she was introduced to Chekhov and Shakespeare. According to Netribution, Kelly didn't just sit around waiting for fame. Even as a teenager, this woman boldly penned a letter to an artistic director demanding a role. And guess what? It worked! Before she knew it, Riley had actually landed a role on Prime Suspect. At 17, Riley packed her bags and headed straight to London. She left her ordinary life behind, and according to Kelly, it was the scariest thing she has ever done till now. But maybe Beth Dutton's role can top that. Personal Therapy – Acting You won't believe this, but behind all those dazzling performances as Beth Dutton lies a story of resilience and strength. According to The Scotsman, Riley didn't just toughen up for the camera, she used acting as her own personal therapy session. Only Kelly can turn pain into power. On several occasions, 
Kelly has spilled the beans about how diving into a role helped her bounce back from a rough breakup. She channeled the strength of her characters to conquer her own demons. But wait, it gets even more inspiring. In an interview with E.T., Kelly revealed that her portrayal of fierce Beth Dutton has struck a chord with women everywhere. In fact, it has turned Riley into a beacon of empowerment. Hasn't she got that special spark? But it begs the question, how has Riley's love life looked over time? Didn't she used to date J.J. Field? Relationships, new and old. Okay, so currently we know that Kelly is married to her dashing beau, Kyle Bogger. The sparks between them flew when they first crossed paths at a swanky social event in London back in 2010. With their shared passion for arts, it was inevitable that they'd hit it off. So, just two years later, this couple sealed the deal in a small ceremony in picturesque Somerset, England. The fairy tale vibes. And get this, while Kelly shines on the silver screen, Kyle is the secret behind her success. Kyle is a financial whiz with a heart of gold and provides her with a stable foundation to do that. The ultimate power couple? We think so. However, despite their decade-long romance, Riley and Bogger are masters at keeping things low-key. They always fly under the radar, leaving fans clamoring for more glimpses. But, 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 we've got some gossip about Kelly's past romances. Did you know she had a brief thing with the Israeli heartthrob Jonah Lotan? Yep, these two met on the set of the TV drama He Kills Coopers back in 2008. But here's what's fascinating, their on-screen chemistry didn't just remain contained to the set. They took their romance off-screen and into the real world. We're imagining the steamy scenes playing out behind the scenes, but as all good things must come to an end, Riley and Lotan's romance fizzled out after just a year. What went wrong? We don't know completely, but one thing is for sure. If things hadn't ended with Lotan, Kelly would have never met Kyle. It's also true that while Lotan is no stranger to the spotlight, thanks to his roles in hit TV shows like ER and Generation Kill, his relationship with Kelly catapulted him into even greater fame. Now, we have some interesting scoops on Kelly's relationships, and this one goes beyond Lotan as well. This British actor had a fling with another British heartthrob, J.J. Field. Can you believe it? Sparks flew between Riley and Field around 2001 to 2002. They ignited a fiery romance that was fueled by, guess what? Their shared passion for theater and film. But here's where it gets even more scandalous. Their love story kicked off thanks to some well-connected friends within the showbiz industry. Can you imagine the star-studded introductions that paved the way for this sizzling romance? But Riley and Field's love affair also fizzled out within a year. Just as we don't know what went wrong between Lotan and Riley, the same goes for Field as well. Could it all be fate? Maybe. Field is no stranger to the spotlight. This man showed his impressive acting jobs in hits like Northanger Abbey and Turn, Washington Spies. But of course, his romance with Riley added that extra layer of intrigue to his Hollywood persona. Whatever the reasons for Kelly's romances failing, we're always going to be rooting for the happiness of our Beth Dutton. All we can think about is what role she's going to play next as Yellowstone ends. What do you think? Do you like Kelly more now that you know about her Hollywood romances and humble background? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe for more. See you next time.